Hello, my name is Slow Ninja, and welcome back to the channel. And in today's episode, we're going to play some more Motorsport Manager and our Aston Martin Let's Play. So, yeah, well, as you can see, we are very secure. I mean, we're on target. I think we are. Are we in third? We are in third place with a good, healthy lead over McLaren, Alpine, and also Ferrari are slowly began to creep their way through. We look at sponsors. We do have to get a new sponsor for this race. So, It'd be interesting to see who will appear as a sponsor. But anyway, looking at our fast result, we got another second place. I mean, don't get me wrong, but we're grabbing results left, right, and center. And I honestly feel like if we can get a bit lucky, we could win a race. But anyway, moving on, let's have a look at our pit crew. Do have anybody who we could potentially swap over you're all still pretty tired do anybody not really I mean tend to get in a 19 is good but I want I need 20s somebody's launching their own cookbook oh it's me uh, reserve driver I'm just making a cookbook your improving parts. Let's go for something like that. Did we dismiss Vitell's party? Oh, he's he's on the parties on party circuit. You cheeky devil. Fatel. But let's go for something like that. I mean, do we need to do? I mean, I guess we can at the end of the day. It's someone's birthday, is that my reserve driver? No, we've got the money. Let's throw him a big... I said we had the money. We spent it all last episode, didn't we? I completely forgot that we spent all our money on last episode, but... Get a new rear wing designed. On which... Reliability, once again, will have to come... to play well that looks all seem to be all to be well pretty good anyway so uh, look at that engine that engine's gonna have no problems what's how so to the black sea finally sponsorships now which one will give us the most money of course you would go for that one but would it be cheaper? Let's just go for that. Let's just grab the most money, as much money as we can. Get some money in the kitty. So that means we can now design a new part. Potentially new brakes. I mean, brakes would be nice. I don't. I don't like that high end. Um, I'm just creating a really crazy engine. It's just all about performance. <laughs> it's a potential. I just feel like we need to just upgrade. I'm kind of happy just to take this car to the end of the to the end of the season, really. I mean, we can always keep building stuff, but for me, I'm kind of happy for where we are. I mean. I 
Do I have anything which really... We could do that. I'm going to bump that up to... Let's just make this is that. I feel like that would be happy. So we compare that part to be roughly about the same, so I'm happy with that. But anyway, let's actually get to the race. Fortunately, no new parts just as yet, so. I mean, engines are right there. Rear wing will come and have to come in for next race. But anyway, let's well, let's just jump straight to qualifying. So that was actually a very good session for us. I mean, both our car, we know, or not, no, the car setup is both 98% on both cars. So that is really, really good for us. And hopefully, we can have a good race. I'm actually tempted to try and get... We were both really quick, so I'm only tempted to try and see if we can get both cars through the first session on some soft tyres. That would be quite nice. Let's see what we normally do. Turn this on. It's quite a short lap as well. I mean, Vettel should be fine. And so should Stroll. Both cars. Both cars have seem to have made it through on a pair of soft tyres. Now here's the plan, do we try the same plan with Fatel in second? To try and spice things up a little bit differently by putting him on the soft tyres. Because I feel like that could definitely work. And then one's soft and right at the end of the race is shuffle them two bits of ultras. So you've got Maspian, Latifi, Hockenberg, Giannazzi, Fern, De Costa, and Danny Kafir on his home Grand Prix. You know what? Let's. Let's actually try it. I'm actually really want to try this and see if I can actually pull this off. That's where it means we've got pace, and when we put them on the ultras, oh, Fatal made a mistake. Even if I tell him a mistake, he's not that silly off the pace. Come on, way into the final minute was because it's such a quick lap around here. I'm still going to risk it with Fatel on a set of softs. Can he go quicker? He should go quicker. Oh no. Oh. Fettel has just made it through. And Stroll once again out qualified by the Williams of Russell.
it just shows how quick Russell is in a slower car from our car. So anyway, it's Russell, Stroll, Yuki, Raikkonen, Carlos Hans Jr., Ocon, and Schumacher. I mean, I think it went hard for second slow. So, you know, we've got that time. We would have been up in sixth place. But now we get... So now this is the booty thing. We can now waste two tyres. And still have four tyres for the, the end of the race. That's the beautiful part about this plan. And only half a second off. That's not too bad. I mean, a fifth place would be quite nice. Charles Leclerc has crashed. So, will that be set to Ferrari? Surely that's sector one, isn't it? I mean, a fifth place. That's not bad. And Faltry Botas with pole position. I mean, he loves Russia in real life, so. I guess that's just kind of. led into the same thing, really, of him. love from Russia in this game, I guess. I mean. Yeah, it's a good. It's enough a good result for us. Fifth place. Uh, we're gonna have so much fun towards the end of the race. I mean, his tyres will be about roughly forty. And how much? Yeah, he can easily do that. Maybe even on a one stopper if we're careful. I may even do the same with a uh, stroll actually. Put him on the set of softs and won't do ultras to the very end. So it's Botas Hamilton, Verstappen, Alonso, Vettel, Norris. I mean, look at their ties already compared to our ties. Raikkonen, Perez, Leclerc, Gasly, Russell, Stroll, Yuki, Raikkonen, Sainz, Ocon, Schumacher, Maspin, Latifi, Hockenberg, Giannazzi, Fern, Da Costa and Kvyat. What can Vettel do here? I have a poor start. And I mean a very poor start. And Hamilton should get, does he get penalised? He doesn't know, oh, what a surprise. I mean, even Stroll's got in front of Fettel. But Hamilton's dropping down. Hamilton's got a real problem here. Hamilton did come into the pits. Is that Norris? Yeah, it has to be Norris. Good overtake there from Patel. Botas crazy. In the middle goes Patel. Up into sixth place. Oh, wow. What happened there? Somebody punted him. And I drive. Oh, uh, wait a sec. This is what I'm talking Why do I get the drive through penalty? Oh, this is frustrating. Can we do the pit stop first?
Well, that's now a fat house race now over with. That's now screwed us big time. Why do I get the penalty and everything? That cow's gonna get a lap before the end of this race. Let's have to turn up the speed to well. I mean, you expect on Fatal to catch up. But it's just gonna be a very long race. I don't know, are we out here going quicker from the cars in front? No, we're not. But at least Vettel is gaining very slowly. Now we're hitting the same speed. I think the tires have gone off the cliff. And we're now up into 20th. That's saying something at least. Where's Hamilton? I mean, Hamilton's already up to 12. When things go bad for you on Motorsport Manager, they really go bad. How the hell has Hamilton already gone up to ninth place? So see, we're clearly getting on Norris. That's really good to see. Oh, Gasly had a pit. A lot of drivers are beginning to pit now. Let him free stroll. He's not your race. Sappen's had a problem. For Sappen has been overtaken. So not so now first place. Is he net P1? How on earth has Fatel <laughs> got all the way up into eleventh place? Now into 10th place. What a drive there from Fettel. We can get to lap, lap 36. And I'll be a very happy man. I mean, Fettel is on a mission today. How much quick is he going quick? How much? Or how much? It's only a tenth quicker. I mean, that's just crazy how. I'm Gasly's got a problem. Come on, Fetter. I know you can uh, take uh, him the ass. What's the problem, Miss? Missed what I was planning to reach. <laughs> I mean, do I pit? Um, if I pit, I just feel like if I pit them both now, get the double stop in. With no mistake. Oh, 
Vettel is out of the Grand Prix. No, 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 no. It's all down to Mr. Lanstro. Here, are we going quicker? No, we're not. Not that car which we should be. Now that we are. Depends on what the next lap, next lap is. Hell oh my. He's going like this known tomorrow. I want you to push these tires anyway. That's the whole tire point of doing this tactic. I'm with both test now having a problem. Could we get a cheeky top six finish? So is this really gonna affect our points? Which I think is the bit which annoys me the most. Condition in the car is absolutely fine. Let's put you in now. So the issue is it's such a long pit stop. Go out on seventh. Question is, can we catch the cars in front? Well, that's ghastly now, kind of over and done with. For a top 10 finish. It's just, ah, oh, that's really annoying. It's just an annoying thing where we get the penalty, but nobody else does. Into F place. That's really smacked these for the final laps. They were really far. Maybe we're taking stroll. Oh no. How we got past science? At least Alonso's had a problem. So he's now dropped down behind Ricardo. How do we? Oh no, he came out last minute. Oh well. It's an eighth place finish. That's what you kind of expect with Stroll. Of course, a little bit disappointed with Fatel for crashing out. We could have got a double points finish there. Could have even had somebody in the top five, potentially. But that's really going to be really bad for our points. Hopefully, uh, like a McLaren or Alonso gets fine. That's the dream scenario for us. But I can guarantee none of them will get fined. Yeah, unfortunately not. Only the one crash, which is Fettel, which is... We had such a healthy lead on the constructors, and now McLaren's just pulled it right back out underneath our noses. Duh. I mean, the penalty wasn't too bad, but as long as Vettel isn't injured, we may be okay. Yeah, you're not going to be very happy with me. 
I don't want to see that screen off all the negatives. Sorry if you can hear a loud humming. We've got a lot of planes flying over recently. But let's have a look at our mail. He's listened to offers. I don't really care, I'm sorry to say. Let's respond. Uh, it's a bad mistake. It's my fault. I can take the happiness hit. It's such a small happiness hit, but if I tell it's fine. That's the main thing. We've got Japanese Grand Prix next, pit crew, everything. But we can do that next ep at the start of next episode. So if you enjoyed this episode, make sure to leave a like. Any comments would be appreciated for near around here, like the content which I make. Well, make sure to subscribe to get more daily content. Till next episode, see you later.